What's up everyone, Take Down here. Welcome back to another video. Today I'm going to be showing you guys how to fix grainy videos when recording with the Canon M50. Let's get right into this. So one thing that has happened to me a while ago is I noticed videos that I recorded with my Canon M50 had a little bit of a grainy texture to them whenever it was me wearing a dark shirt or had a dark background behind me and it bugged the crap out of me. So after doing research, I found out how to fix it. Now the videos that I already had recorded, I can't go and really fix the grainy texture for them. I decided just to upload them on the channel anyways, but I did get to fix it on the camera itself for any videos that I record after that. So the problem is the ISO was a little bit too high. What I was recording on was the automatic ISO and that did cause issues for me. Now I do have a ring light and you definitely do want to have a ring light if you are having this issue because by lowering the ISO, it does have a lot of dark features to the video that you're recording. By having a ring light or a couple lights, then you can combat the darkness and all of the grainy texture in the video does go away. So right now, because it is something that I'm gonna be showing you guys on my Canon M50, I'm gonna to have to switch over to recording with my smartphone just for a second, just to show you guys what I am talking about and how to fix the issue. So here we are, here is the screen for the Canon M50. I always record in uh, movie recording. So you're gonna choose mode. Now, as you can see, I'm already on manual because that is what I record in, but I'm just gonna show you what I was recording in, and that is the auto exposure. So for the camera here, if I press the button, in the bottom right corner, you see the ISO is automatically at 5,000, which is extremely high. So for any videos that there is any dark in the background, or if you're wearing a dark shirt, then it will look extremely grainy and it will bug the crap out of you. What you're gonna to want to do is switch it back to movie recording. And from here, you're gonna choose your mode. You're gonna go into manual and hit okay. Now for it here in the bottom right corner, now you can manually select your ISO. For me personally, I leave it around 800 to 1600. And I usually record, except for today where the lighting is actually amazing in here, usually I will record with a ring light and that will combat the low light quality. Now I do know that that was hard to follow with the smartphone, me recording the screen of the Canon M50, but just like I did explain, you are going to want to record in the manual movie recording setting instead of automatic. That way you have more control over it and you actually get to select the ISO and instead of it being automatic and with you moving the camera around in different lighting situations, it automatically changing the ISO, you get to leave it set at a specific number. Normally I leave it set between 800 and 1600, but typically I leave it at 800 and record with a ring light. It's just today I'm recording in front of the window. I have great lighting right now, natural lighting. I don't need to record with the ring lights, even though my ISO is at 800. And one thing I didn't really explain very well is what I mean by the grainy video. So anytime you're wearing black or have a black or dark background, it looks like it is almost fluttering and moving across your shirt and it looks extremely terrible, especially when you're trying to make quality videos for your YouTube channel. So I did have this problem a while back. I think there was three or four videos that had it in it and I decided to research it to look up how to fix it for future videos so I didn't have this issue occur and that's when I realized I was recording an automatic and it was just changing the ISO anytime I changed and was recording in different lighting situations. Now after switching to manual, I don't have the problem, it's just when I'm recording in low light situations, the video that I'm recording is gonna be extremely dark because the ISO number is really low. Now to combat this, when I'm recording with a dark background and the ISO is at 800 and it really sh doesn't show anything that's behind me, it just shows me with a blackout background instead of showing anything that's really behind me on my collectible shelves or anything like that. I do record with the ring lights, that way it does show everything that is behind me without a grainy texture behind it. Of course, 
you could not worry about the ISO and you could record with it in automatic or with a higher number, but your videos are gonna come out extremely grainy. It's better just to record the ISO at a lower number and record with a ring light. It comes out beautiful. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video on how to fix grainy videos recording with your Canon M50. I believe this is the same thing with other cameras as well. You just have to figure out where to go about switching your ISO. That is what you need to look for if you are having grainy videos with other cameras. You just want to be around the 800 to 1600 range. Preferably, they say you want to be lower than 800, but I just can't get behind how dark it turns out whenever I'm lower than 800. So I do like to have nice videos and good quality videos. That's why I stick around the 800 mark. I hope you guys enjoyed this video and I hope this fixed the grainy videos for you. I'm gonna leave this video here. Please take care, peace.